I ain't trying to keep niggas on long, man. We just really getting to this game, and we just really talking and vibing, and let me do what I got to do right here, right? All right. We ready for some game? Let's do it. A nigga from Virginia. Right, star ball smack. He say, boss, man, I'm a 27-year-old nigga with a few meaningless side bitches on a team and a main 25-year-old bitch. My main bitch is a 25-year-old bitch. Me and my main bitch that did a Vegas trip for four days. We was up in the Venetian. It was a good trip, or so I thought. When I got home, I got word from a trusted source that my bitch went out to Vegas and linked up with another nigga on the low. This was incredible to me because this was incredible to me. However, me and my bitch did go in two different directions one day. I linked up with some of my peoples out there, and she told me she had went shopping. The bitch had even purchased me some Air Maxes. I never seen any evidence of whole treachery. I never felt any weird energy. However, my source is valid. How should I address this shit? Should I blow up the spot with my information? All right. All right. Now, okay. Here's my thing. Um, I'm never, I got to have the evidence, man. I'm never really, okay, because see, look. Okay, couple things. How is your bitch treating you? Have things been good? Have you been go good terms with your bitch? Have you and your bitch been good? Have things been okay? Has life been regular? If things have been regular and things have been good, you haven't noticed no disrespect, no weird shit happening. You got to be careful. Now, okay. Now, there is such thing as sabotage. There is such thing as people giving false information to throw you off, right? There is such thing as that for whatever reason. You know what I'm saying? If you did not see the if you did not see anything weird with your bitch, if you do not feel nothing weird with your bitch, do not do not do not approach with an accusation because that may make you look insecure scared you know what i'm saying i say monitor your bitch keep an eye on your bitch and see how she's treating you is she still fucking you the same is she still treating you with the same respect and admiration and just keep the vibe going and see if you notice any signs of disrespect if you don't notice no disrespect fuck it man you know what i'm saying you don't know if 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 your trip to Vegas was flawless and good and you had a good time and you didn't know nothing until you came home and people told you some words like some shit was happening, hey, man, listen, man, don't let nobody throw a monkey wrench into your shit, man. You always got to do your own investigations, man. Do your own investigations. If you don't see nothing, you don't see nothing. If you see something, you see something. You know what I'm saying? If you, you know, now I don't condone going through phones and shit like that. But I mean, you know what I'm saying? Do not just accuse a bitch of some shit without the facts, without some proof, without some, you know what I'm saying? Some, you know what I mean? You gotta have something. You know what I mean? You gotta have something. And, you know, even if a bitch did go out there and link up with a motherfucker, if the respect for you is unchanged, if you didn't notice shit, man, you might as well keep shit going until you notice disrespect. That's the way I say. 